The just reappointed governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, Godwin Emefele, in company of the governor of Enugu State and the chancellor of the University of Nigeria, Nsuka, made their way into this hall for this special convocation ceremony. The rendition of the school anthem awakens a lot of memories for the governor, who was once a student and a lecturer of this great citadel of learning. The governor of the Apex Bank at this event delivered a lecture on the story of Nigeria's economic recovery from recession. He spoke on steps that were taken immediately by the bank to salvage the nation's economy from impending doom. The recovery has been driven largely by improved non-oil activities, especially the agriculture sector, which expanded consistently by about 3.5 to 4.3 percent representing government's efforts at diversifying the economy. The recovery has been sustained for seven consecutive quarters. The pace of quarterly GDP growth has improved from 0.5% in the second quarter of 2017 to 2.38% during the fourth quarter of 2018. But how effective have these policies introduced by the Apex Bank fed? The pace of economic recovery has so far remained very slow, leaving GDP growth around just 2%. Yes, we agree that the growth numbers are low. But we've somewhat been able to um, check inflation. We've, we've, uh, we've brought it down. Yes, we're talking about price and monetary stability as a core mandate. But we have told ourselves at the monetary policy that we're going to talk, be talking about price and monetary stability, but that is conducive to growth. It, we will make it very difficult for people to circumvent economic policies. The governor believes that building on measures implemented by the fiscal and monetary authorities is critical to achieving sustainable economic growth and will ultimately reduce the country's reliance on proceeds from the sale of crude oil. From Enugu State, Chinamarim, Joseph, STV News.